can make you cry, can make you see. When all around the world falls down, hang on to Jesus, he will give you a crown. He will give you a crown. We're just going to loosen up just a little bit. We can't be too religious because we just want to rejoice in God tonight. We just want to rejoice in God tonight. I said we just want to rejoice in God tonight. Hallelujah. 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 We can just put aside everything that will hold you back. We can just put aside every religious, traditional spirit. And we can lift our heads to heaven. And lift our hands to the sky. And worship the King of Kings. And the Lord of Lords. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God, we worship you. We worship you tonight. We've come in this place tonight, oh God. Just to meet with you. We're here tonight, oh God. Just to worship you. To fix our eyes upon you. To surrender our hearts unto you. For you are worthy. You are holy. And you are great. And mighty. Hallelujah. 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 I was in Pakistan a few months ago. At the, beginning, at the beginning of the meeting, two ushers ushered in an elderly woman that was 100% blind. She sat in a seat. And as I preached the word of God, I wasn't praying for the sick. I was declaring the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. And while I was preaching, God opened her eyes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. She came on stage at the end of the night and testified. I stood next to her and gazed at her. And she was just going like this. The glory of God was upon her. For here is a woman that once was blind. But now she can see. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I was in India a few years ago. There was an elderly man, he was 91 years old. That evening I called folk to the to the front to pray for them for sickness. I remember this elderly man standing about here, right on the front. Lay my hands upon his head. You see, I looked into his eye. There were no pupils. Just white. No pupil. Just white. Laid my hands and said, Touch me, holy in Jesus' name. Moved on, moved on to the next. Man turned and wandered back to his seat. I continued prayer for the sick. And then at the close of the night, I didn't hear about it till later on. I didn't hear it till later. The man came to the front. Met a pastor standing on the front. Said, My eyes. I can see. Listen, I got 
the pastor a few days later to follow up this man and to take a photo of his eyes, his face. He sent me the picture. And this was the man. Just white for eyes. And now I can see pupils. He could see clearly at 91 years old, he was born with no pupils. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And let me tell you tonight, this is the heart and the desire of God. And God has not changed. He's the same God. When I read of Jesus in the New Testament walking on the face of this earth, they brought the lame, they brought the sick, those with fever. Those with leprosy. I want only isolated. Those bound by devils. I want to hear today. And I read in the Word of God. That the presence of Jesus was there to heal and to deliver. Hallelujah. The presence of Jesus. Jesus hopped into a boat and crossed the lake of Galilee and stepped upon the shore. And I read in the word the people recognized Jesus. They recognized Jesus. And so they ran to the villagers went to their homes and gathered those that were oppressed gathered those bound by devils gathered the sick the diseased those that were injured they brought them to Jesus says Lord just one touch from you. They said, Jesus, if we could just touch you. Even like the woman with an issue of blood who pushed through the crowd. For she spent all her money on doctors, specialists. And still she grew worse. But when she heard Jesus was coming by and she recognized Jesus, she said, I must just touch him. Just what touch even of the hem of his garment. And I know I shall be made well. And so she pushed her way through the crowd and reached out and touched him. And the moment she touched him, power, power flowed through her body and made her well. Oh, glory to God. Oh, glory to God. Now listen, Jesus turned and said, Who touched me? Now we read an account of that day. And the Bible says there was a great multitude of people. And the crowd pressed hard against him. Many people were touching him. But this one woman reached out in faith, touched him in faith, recognizing that he is the only one who is able, recognized that he is her hope, her future, her healer, her deliverer, and in faith, she touched him. And Jesus turned and said, Who touched me? And people said, Many people are touching you, Jesus. He said, No. No. One person touched me. 
Any kind of fear will come with purpose. By Louis Emery, come in expectation. By Louis Emery, come in faith. Someone touch. By Louis Emery, come in fear will come. The woman said, "It is I." Oh, we know. So I pray, me and you know. Jesus says, "Go, your faith has made you whole." Then we say, "Pray, my Lord, if I go, I'm more than that." Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.
right across the earth today. I believe God is looking and weeping. You're crying out. You've missed time of your visitation. As men and women have hardened their hearts. Even in the name of God. Even calling him Lord. Lord, Lord, Lord. Lord. On that great day. Jesus declared. Yes, you saw many. Many. Who call me Lord. But I will turn to them and say, Depart from me, you workers of iniquity, you breakers of my Lord, you keepers of secret sin. But Lord, 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 I was a Lord, in your name, I lay hands in your name. I lay hands upon the sick. They recovered me. In your name, I cast out devils. In your name, I prophesied. Depart from me. You work is of iniquity. And it is only he. It is only he. And you cannot show show. Who does the will of my father who is in heaven, who will enter my kingdom. Miss the visitation of God. They had a form of religion of faith. that looked right and fooled many. But Yet living in sin. You see Jesus writing in the book of Revelation to his churches. Declare you look alive, you have a name. But you're wretched, naked, and blind. Return to your first love. There were many that were neither hot nor cold, but tried to walk somewhere in the middle. Lukewarm. Wanting God. Yet wanting the world. Lukewarm. God declared unto them. You must either be hot or cold. For the lukewarm I shall spew forth from my mouth. Jesus. Jesus. You see, Paul declared. We must declare the full gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I am not afraid or ashamed. How good are to you? For it is the full gospel that leads men unto salvation. Do 
And we must consider both the kindness and the severity. For yes, he is a God of love. Of compassion, of kindness, of forgiveness. He is patient. Yet, he is a God that is holy. A God of justice, of righteousness. He is a God of judgment. That it begins in the house of God. And tonight, yes, God will declare His power and show forth His mighty works. Those that are sick shall be free. And when they are shy, so near by those with disease healed. I want And those bound and tormented shall be delivered and set free. And the weak made strong. I want you But let me tell you tonight. This is the mercy and the love of God. That declares and shows forth. How much she loves you. How much she loves you. But then we have a responsibility to to surrender to him. To turn from our sin. To forsake everything that would bring offense unto God. For once we hear the truth of the gospel and experience the glory and the power of God, yet, yet we do not fully respond. But continue in half heartedness. As lukewarm. And Paul declared, writing to the church Do not deceive yourself. Do not be deceived. He's not talking to the world. He's talking to believers. He's talking to the church of God. Do not deceive yourself. The greedy. I want to get the greedy. I want you go for the swindler. I want to you know what about the liar. I want the deceiver. I want that song. The sexual immoral. I want all go for a The drunkard. I want And we could go on all night. I want my son. These shall not enter the kingdom of God. For what would it profit a man if he gained the whole world? But in doing so, lose this is very sorry. The problem today. There is no fear of God in the hearts. There is no fear of God in the hearts of men. And so they wander astray. They walk in the world. They walk in love of God, yet love of the world, in lukewarmness. For they love the sin greater than they fear God. Yet Proverbs declares it is through the fear of God that men depart from evil. Through 
through truth, iniquity is purged. And through the fear of God, men depart and turn aside from evil. Oh, we need a revelation of the holiness of God. Why do we worship Him? Why do we serve Him? Why obey Him? Why surrender to God? I'll tell you why. For He is worthy. He is worthy. And besides him, there is no other. Besides him, there is no other. He alone has the power to forgive sin. In his name alone. The name of Jesus. There is healing. There is freedom. There is deliverance. There is pardon. There is wholeness. There is hope. There is life eternal. And he alone is worthy. Do we just seek him for what we can get out of him? Shame on you. Oh girl with you for Do we seek him even to miss hell? Do we seek him just to miss hell? Shame on you. Oh girl with you. Although, yes, he promises all of this. It is not why we serve him. We serve him. And say, for he is worthy. For he is God. And besides him, there is no God. Hallelujah. For my people perish for lack of knowledge. I want your mission. My people are destroyed for the lack of understanding. For the fear of God is the beginning of wisdom. I'm reminded of the words of Job. Now he was a man. A righteous man. In all the earth there was none found more righteous than Job. Who believed and honored God. Who was greatly blessed. And then you know the story. It was all taken from him and stripped away. He was attacked. Abandoned. Calamity came upon him. He lost everything. 
Listen to the words of Job. Remember, this was a righteous man. But once he was stripped of everything and humbled and broken, and when he came out through the valley of the shadow of death, once again to walk in green pastures. Listen to what he said. My God, for once in the past, my ears had heard of you. But now, now, my eyes behold you in all your glory. If your presence would stand by me. 
Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no For your presence, your presence, your presence, your glory, stand by me. Oh, what I know me. And in a moment, and even now, God is touching and healing you. Right now, God is beginning to move. With healing, power and glory. Sickness is gone. Sickness is gone. Sickness is gone. It's gone. I son Lord. Disease is gone. I want to know. Devils are gone. I want to know. Right now. You know what I want you. God is moving amongst you. I love who we are going. But listen to me. You want that to see me. What would it matter if our bodies were healed, but we don't surrender our souls? You don't know my mouth was son. To live in a miracle for 30, 40, 80 years, but spend eternity in hell. You can take his healing, his miracle now, yes. Song by was on song by Shay Yanubai. See me. But take the miracle of eternal life. Take the greatest miracle of eternal life and take your healing of your body tonight as well. Hallelujah! 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 Thank you, Jesus. Oh, He is worthy. Oh, yeah, He is worthy. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, He is worthy. Oh no, yeah. He's worthy. Oh no, yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes. Reach out to him right now. Lord, make us one. Make us one. That together we may glorify the sun. With our hearts open wide. By your side. And may the glory of the Lord. Be seen in now die. Come on, reach out tonight, Lord. Me, draw close to Him tonight. Glorify Him with our hearts open wide. May we abide by Your side, and may the glory of the Lord be seen in now die.
It's not who we are. It's not who we were. It's who we become. We become the glory of God through Jesus Christ. We become a new creation. Born again. Not of the spirit of this world. But by the spirit of Almighty God. Not by the seed of man. But of the seed of the Father who is in heaven. We become the children of Almighty God. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. I feel the presence of God. His glory is in this place right now. I want every person that needs a miracle, that needs a healing, those, those that are sick, that are injured, those that are weak, those that are bound in torment, I want you to, I want you to move to the front right now. Move out of your seat to come to the front right now. I'm going to pray for you. Quickly come. Quickly come. You need a miracle tonight. I want all those of you who are not living for God. Those who are not living for God. Those who believe but are not knowing Him. I want you to come and surrender to Him. You may have known Him. Amen. But you have not known Him. Amen. 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 Darkness and step into the light. Tonight is the night to put aside hypocrisy. And let the truth of God set you free tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The other hand of God is placed upon the sickness. An injury, a weakness. That you know for God. Because when you were crucified. And you gave your life. 
And by those stripes we were healed. So right now, God, according to your word and the prayer of faith, in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of Almighty God, let every sickness and disease be healed in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Let every spirit of infirmity be loosed. Every devil that binds, go! And let the weak say, I am strong. Your father, Baba, from heaven. Let the healing power of God lift up your hands to heaven and say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for healing. Oh, Jesus, Thank you for that miracle tonight. In Jesus' name. Be made whole. I saw you do. Be healed. Let every trace of disease be gone. Let every sickness be gone. It was cursed that we would be healed. In Jesus' name. Be made whole. I saw you do. Now I want every person to move your body. Do something. Do something you couldn't do before. Thank you, Jesus. 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 My God. Every blind, blind eye be open. Every blind eye be open. Every sickness be made whole. Be unstopped. Let crippled limbs be strengthened. Let heart disease be healed. Diabetes be gone. Those that suffer from seizures be set free in the name of Jesus. Every skin condition be made whole. Tumors be gone. In fact, right now, in the name of Jesus, tumors be gone. Disappear in the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Let every trace of disease and sickness be healed in the name of Jesus. Oh, glory. God's moving right now. God's moving right now. Oh, glory. 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 glory. Just receive. Just receive. 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 In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Powers of darkness fleeing right now. I want to have you go my salon. No, no, no. Demons dispelled in the name of Jesus. I am not going to you. Devils, your hold is broken because Jesus sets them free. You will rule no longer in these bodies. You have no authority. 
But in the authority of Jesus, I cast you out. Be gone. Let the backslider backslide no more. Let the backslider backslide no more. Let the sinner sin no more. Let the powers of darkness be broken. Let the bondage of sin be broken. Be made whole. Be washed. Be cleansed. Be sanctified. moving right here, right now. The glory of God is in this place. The glory of God is in this place right now. It's the glory. Touch the glory. Touch the glory. Touch the glory. 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 Glory, 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 loose in Jesus' name. Loose in Jesus' name. Loose in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Touch. Touch. Glory, 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 Jesus, Jesus. Since September last year, she will feel ill in her body. And every day she has spent a lot. But when she got here, and she felt comfort, and when you lay your hand on her, and see the water was poured on her. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Sister, just come. Yes. And sister with the white hanky, bring her. Bring her. This sister with the baby, just bring her. Sister with the baby, bring her. 
This gentleman in the green shirt comes. And, and this sister too, here you come as well. Hallelujah. What, 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 what has God done? What, what do you feel? You know, see, I read the wrong teaching. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That he won't pray, no one will pray. Why you were praying? And say, if it's me, shake. It will see the leg of this boy vibrating. The leg was vibrating. Hallelujah. God's doing something. Praise God. What's happened, sister? You know, share when people cannot talk and she cannot hear. Father, in the name of Jesus, Amen. open his ears. Amen. Open his mouth. Amen. In Jesus' name, be loosed from this death dumb. Amen. Thank you, Lord. 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 Precious, precious God. Thank you, Lord. I have seen so many death down here. So many I have seen. Too many to count. And I thank you, Father, that this precious girl, the ears are open. What's happened, sister? You said she couldn't stand for five minutes. But since morning, she has been standing and nothing happened to her. She's appreciating God for that. Glory to God. Glory to God. Sister, what has God done tonight? Hallelujah. I prayed for the touch of God in my life. And as we were praying, and the man of God laid the signs of one man. And I felt the touch of God. One week, we are not to feel welcome. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Brother, tell me. As I'm praying, I noticed that the God touched me, and before I used to have that pain, tell her any man do more, she won't buy you go to long. As you go for long. Praise God, praise God. Sister, what's God done tonight? Oh, you've spoken, you have. Indeed. Sister. Said the baby has not been working. My God, let these legs be strengthened. Let the power of God flow through every limb. In the name of Jesus, my God, bring muscles, strengthen every tissue, every cell. In the name of Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. One yes and one year, that's your little project. Let the power of God come through this hip, come through the leg, come through every part of his body and make him whole. Amen. 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 Keep walking, Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Thank you, God. 
Now lift your hand again if God has healed you tonight. Just show me God has touched you tonight. Hallelujah. We've got more here. Yes. Praise the Lord. Um, for the past few years, I've been feeling this heart pain within my heart. And as I was praying here, I felt the touch of God. And I felt this relief within me. And ever since that time, I've not been feeling the pain. Hallelujah. And wonderful Lord bless. In the name of Jesus, go free in Jesus' name. Amen. Jesus' name. God's just begun to move tonight. Now tomorrow we we'll want you to go to your neighbors and re up your friends. Bring the people to this place tomorrow night. Let's fill the whole field. And let's come expecting greater things. God's moving right now. And He will continue to move over these things. Come expecting more from God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. God bless you. Amen.